Ah, that's G Fuel on my fucking leg. The Final Fantasy VII remake finally came to PC after almost two years. Um, so you would expect Square Enix, with all that time, to release a competent PC port, but it is far from that, and a lot of people are experiencing a shit ton of performance issues. And I'll be showing you guys how to fix a lot of those performance issues. I, I, well, not a lot of them, but hopefully at least some of them. Like, so basically what the problem boils down to, I'm not going to get into it. And I will show you guys a clip of me just standing in an area and the game just giving me 30 FPS because it fucking blows. So now we're at, uh, we hit uh, 29 FPS there, 30 FPS. Um, so what the problem is, is that the game runs in DirectX 12. <sighs> DirectX 12 fucking sucks. Press this little line here, go to settings, go all the way down to your game. Check this, uh, additional command line arguments, and write a dash DX11. Now what this will do is it'll run the game in Direct DirectX 11. So... That will fix most of your performance issues. So a lot of the micro stutters and the frame dips in some areas, gone. Easily. So I don't know what... I really don't know what they did. Um, but that's... That's pretty much it. Uh, it's not... It's a really easy fix. Another thing people have been complaining about is the fact that dynamic resolution is automatically on. And the game doesn't give you an option to turn it off because that'd be too hard for Square Enix to do. It would take probably about five seconds for them to do that, but that's a lot of work according to them. So I'll leave a link in the description to a pack that you can download, which will disable dynamic resolution or at least try its best to. So it's not nearly as noticeable as it is when you're just playing and looking in the distance. So once you downloaded that, it will come in a, uh, it'd be like a tilde. And then uh, mods. I think that's what it's called. I don't fucking know. It's too late for this shit. But uh, yeah. And then here's the pack. So what you want to do is you want to find it wherever you downloaded your game. Go to end content packs. And then just drag the folder into here. And as you can see, it will actually run the pack file even though it's not here. So yeah. Thank fucking God somebody went to the effort to make this because that was another issue i was having so basically what will happen is if you turn up your fps to 120 the game will automatically lower your resolution in some areas and make it look worse like in battle um but now there's you don't have that issue it'll run out oh shit they will run out the resolution the entire time so let's go back into the game and i can show you guys that the performance is a lot better and i'll also show you guys that it actually is running in directx 12 DirectX 11, sorry. Okay, so the game started up, and as you can see, if you look in the top left-hand corner, you'll see that it says D3D11, which that means DirectX 11 is now running instead of DirectX 12. You will also be able to see in the loading screen that you can get um, 900 to 1,000 FPS. Now, I'm sure if your computer is more powerful, you get more FPS than I will. Um, but that's what I get, so... The game will also load a lot faster, even though it is on an, I have it in on, on an external hard drive, so it's not an SSD, so it won't load the greatest, but it'll actually load better now because of this. So that's pretty much it. Um, I will show you that the game performs a lot better. You don't have nearly as many frame drops or micro stutters, you can actually move around the game smoothly and it'll actually feel like 120 FPS. It won't feel like you're playing at 30. So as you can see, I'll look around. So I'll just stand here and look around. So you can kind of see a little bit, but not nearly as bad. And if I'm looking in this area, it's still 120 no matter where I look and what I do, which is great. That's exactly how I want it. And there's no dynamic resolution anymore. So once again, modders have to fix these AAA titles. It's incredible. You guys are so fucking incompetent. But anyways, I digress.
that is how you fix all the performance issues. If you guys found this video helpful, please leave a like. Um, that That's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to get off and actually be able to play the game now. I'm actually recording this as I just found out how to fix it. After hours of fucking figuring out, trying to figure out what the fuck's going on. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed. See you guys later. Peace.